Potassium deficiency is when a person has abnormally low levels of potassium in their body. It is also called hypokalemia. Potassium is a mineral that helps regulate fluid in the body and helps muscles and nerves to work properly. It is found inside cells and is essential for good health. Hypokalemia can happen if someone becomes dehydrated. Some medications can cause the body to lose potassium, such as diuretics, fluid tablets. In this video, we'll talk about 8 signs of potassium deficiency. So, let's get started. Number 1. Abdominal cramping or bloating. The digestive tract is lined with smooth muscle tissue and controlled by the autonomic nervous system. Potassium is an electrolyte that helps stimulate functions of the neural network, including digestion. When potassium is lacking, the intestines do not function normally, which, in turn, compromises healthy digestion. Number 2. Fatigue. This is perhaps the most common symptom of potassium deficiency, feelings of fatigue and or exhaustion. Potassium is involved in the functionality of every cell in the body. It is an important part of a well-balanced diet and a critical component of energy production. Of course, not consuming enough of something that produces energy can result in well, less energy. Number 3. Brain Fog. Low levels of potassium can also interfere with normal electrical activity in the brain. When this happens, it may lead to brain fog, overall feelings of confusion, sluggishness, and thinking, and inability to concentrate. Getting enough potassium is essential to brain function, especially for individuals with demanding occupations or when in school. Number 4. Constipation. Since we're on the topic of digestion, it may be best to get this one out of the way. As some of you have undoubtedly guessed, yes, abnormal levels of potassium can cause constipation. It's also worth mentioning that too much potassium can cause the same effects. Number 5. Feelings of thirst or frequent passing of urine. Feeling thirsty or frequent passing of urine can occur when the blood's potassium levels are too low. This is particularly true when the body's sodium levels are also low. When this happens, the kidney's ability to retain water is suppressed, which needs to be released in the form of urine. The body loses its ability to regulate water balance, which can create feelings of frequent and or extreme thirst. Number 6. Heart Palpitations. Potassium is important for the proper regulation of blood pressure. Blood pressure directly affects our heart rate, which means that adequate levels of potassium are important to our heart rate. As such, low levels of potassium can potentially result in irregular heartbeat and even heart palpitations. Number 7. Ringing and vibrating in ears. Since potassium has such an effect on blood pressure and heart rate, Inadequate levels of potassium can indirectly result in ringing or vibrating of the ears. These are often secondary symptoms of irregular heartbeat or heart palpitations. Therefore, maintaining healthy levels of potassium consumption can indeed assist with two problems related to potassium deficiency. Number 8. Skin Problems. According to Dr. Elson M. Haas, author of over a dozen nutrition-based books, Chronic potassium deficiency can manifest into skin problems, including acne and dry skin. As potassium is involved in the healthy functioning of every cell in the body, it is probable that this nutrient also serves some capacity in keeping our skin healthy. How is potassium deficiency diagnosed? Potassium deficiency is diagnosed with a blood test. Your doctor may order a test as part of a routine medical examination, or because you have high blood pressure or kidney disease. If you have low potassium, your doctor may recommend you take a supplement. You should only take a potassium supplement under medical supervision. As having too much potassium in the body can also cause serious health problems. If your levels are very low, you may need potassium through a drip in the hospital. Your doctor may also adjust your medications if they are causing the potassium deficiency. Or recommend you eat more foods that are high in potassium. Most people can prevent potassium deficiency by eating a healthy, balanced diet. If you got value from this video, please give it a thumbs up, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more informative videos like this.